Hey, what is up, you sexy beasts? My name is Shadowfax and or Louise, whichever you want to call me. And today, we've got something to tell you. Yeah, I'm back. <laughs> I'm back and like, not like every day. I'm just like popping in like I do. <laughs> I go so inconsistent with this channel. This channel has actually died because of it, but that's cool, that's fine. Um, yeah, where have I been? Been very busy, been very busy. I actually got married last week, so. That was like a great time, it was glorious. And then by the end of the evening, I got very drunk. I loved everyone, it was amazing. Um, but yeah, I got married last week to my longtime partner, Lucy, who if you've been with the channel for a while, you'll probably have heard her in in videos before. She's been in some of my videos before, but yeah. Got married, um, it's really weird because I've now got a wedding ring on my finger and I'm a married woman and it's really scary and that nah, is cool. Um, I'm, actually, I'm actually like, really like, yes. Now she can't leave me without getting a divorce and that's so much hassle, so she's with me for life. She's stuck with me. <laughs> so yeah, weddings are stressful. <laughs> no, I'm. we had such a good day, but they are very, very stressful when you're like planning them and shit. This is coming from me, who did like basically no planning for the wedding. I ended up leaving it to Lucy and her family to do all the planning and I still got fucking stressed out with it. So you can imagine what she was like. But it turned out to be an amazing day, had a really good time. And uh, now she's mine for life, she can never escape. So, you know, win-win situation. And then also, I've actually changed jobs. If you've uh, been with me for a while, you'll know that I worked as a carer for the elderly and disabled in a care home. And I was doing that for eight years. Uh, not for the same company, but, you know, doing caring for eight years. And I needed a change because, quite frankly, the money is shit and there is no chance of career progression. So, yeah, needed a change. So I now I'm actually doing a year-long apprenticeship to be a field technician, which is basically... Uh, install it and fix phone lines, broadband and uh, TV for Virgin Media and boy am I glad I did it, it's been amazing so far, I only started it, well, officially started in May but I actually started uh, working for Virgin in April because it was like a pre-apprenticeship thing and um, yeah, it's an amazing company to work for and it's kept me very busy lately because like it's an actual apprenticeship, so you've got like to study and all this because it will give you an actual qualification by the end of it. But it's, they've sent me away to Birmingham a few times for training, like for the whole week and stuff, and put me in a very nice fancy hotel, and it was a lovely and I had a lovely time because um, really? I've been having to like learn how to do all this stuff. But they also then you're also working on the job. You have like a mentor who's an experienced technician who you go out with and they teach you on the job how to install and fix these things. And it's been very, very interesting. It's right up my alley. It's very, like, you know, technical stuff to a, to a certain degree. And it's something that I've been really, really enjoying, but it's uh, it's kind of kept me busy. And plus, like, my writer was all over the place for a little while because because I was with my mentor. I had to kind of, like, follow his work pattern. So I was a little bit like, oh, shit, what am I doing? Because it was his rosa, so obviously I didn't know it. But it's now settled down because from Monday... I am actually going out on my own. I'm not going to be with my mentor anymore. I'm going to be going out on my own to customers' houses to install and fix their shit. So, I've now got my rotor sorted out. So, I'm now going to be doing Monday to Friday, 8 till 4. And so, that means every evening and every weekend, I get free to myself. So, I will have more time to do stuff like videos and to do streaming if I so wish. It depends on, you know, I don't, I'm not going to sit here and say, I'm going to be doing all these videos and stuff because I don't know what the fuck I'm going to be doing. Because basically, like, the, the channel at the moment is fucking dead. And that's fine. I understand why it's dead, you know, inconsistency and all that. It's my own fault. And I'm, I'm, I'm not, not mad at myself over it at all. Um, but, like, basically, at one point before, the channel was doing really well. It was, it was gaining a lot of traction. And so, because it was doing really well, I started pumping out videos every day. And that kept the channel going and it kept it growing. Um, but it made it that this had changed from being my hobby that was something that I was doing because I enjoy it because becoming more of an obligation to keep people happy and to keep the channel growing and then it just made it so it wasn't fun anymore and then I got burnt out and then I didn't make any videos at all and all this shit so basically what I'm going to be doing now I'm not going to promise anything because I've promised in the past and I just always break it um I'm just going to be making videos as and when I want I'm going to make the sort of videos that I want when I want and I'm probably going to do probably more streaming than anything because I play every evening. Like, you know how some people are addicted to crack cocaine? Yeah, think about that. 
that's how I am about Player Unknown's Battlegrounds. I am fucking addicted to that game. It's amazing. It's got its issues, but what do you expect from early access? Duh. I don't think they're going to fuck us over like H1 and um, Daisy and all that did. And really enjoying the game. So I'm playing it like literally like every evening with my with my buddies. And um, they're not really my buddies. They just they're just like these people that I I like and I force them to play with me. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, so I've been playing it like every evening. So what we're gonna do is I've got the new computer and I've got my old computer still. So I'm gonna hook them two up together so that I can play on the new computer and use the old computer to stream. And then. I'll probably stream more because it's just easier. Because if I'm just chilling out in the evenings and playing, I might as well stream it. So that's probably what you're going to be seeing from me. Probably stream on Twitch as well, but I'll stream mainly on YouTube. Or maybe I'll stream both to both simultaneously. Who fucking knows? But basically, I am going to be about. You are going to see videos coming out from me and shit like that. But I'm going to be like not doing all this promising bullshit that I always break. I'm just going to be doing stuff as and when I see fit as and when I feel like it to keep it fun for me because if it's not fun for me then the videos that come out are of shit quality and you guys aren't going to enjoy them so there's just you know if we do it this way it's going to be a win-win situation for everyone do you know what I mean like look at Frankie on PC his Daisy videos are fucking amazeballs they take him like a month to just to do one and people are like oh my god I can't believe you don't upload them more well do you know what he spends a whole month doing that, and that video comes out fucking amazing. Like I'm sitting there with my popcorn on the edge of my seat watching this fucking this fucking video. They've turned into a fucking movie. Do you know what I mean? So I'm not saying that like I'm going to be bringing out Frankie on PC's quality of videos because that's just that's just ridiculous. But <laughs> I am going to be like, you know, you're just going to see videos from me when, as and when I see fit, when I think they're good enough. Because what you guys don't know is I do actually make a lot of videos that either end up like private videos that I just keep just for myself, or I make them and then I'm not happy with them. Like I'll, I'll, I'll make videos and I'm not happy with them so they just get scrapped, or I'll make videos and I'm like, do you know what, I'm not going to put that up. That's going to be my little personal collection that I just keep for myself, or... You know, I really want to use this song, but if I put that on YouTube, it's going to get copyrighted, so I'll just keep it in my personal collection. It's like, you know how people have a personal collection of porn? I have a personal collection of gameplay videos. It's really fucking strange, but that's what I do. But anyway, guys, I'm just fucking rambling. You can tell that I'm out of practice with doing these commentaries. But if you've made it this far, fucking love you. Thank you. And I'll see you guys soon. If you ever want to switch to Virgin Media... Let me know, get your good deals. Hashtag Louise is a sellout. And if you ever want to play something like PUBG with me, then hit me up on Steam or whatever, somewhere. Just hit me up somewhere. And as long as it's not inappropriately, you know, like slapping my ass or something. And we'll play together. Anyway, guys, I love you. Bye! Just turned into a bloke. Bye!